Welcome to another edition of ZoomShare Video Help. This segment offers a brief overview of ZoomShare password protection functionality that our site owners can add to the pages of their site and to photo albums. To get started, I've logged into my ZoomShare site and click Site Manager and have noted the lock icon column with check boxes underneath that correspond to each page. I can password protect any page, but I'm going to demonstrate password protection on my blog page today. So I've clicked that check box and entered in the username and password that I'll be giving out to site visitors authorized to access that blog page. Then I'll click Save Changes. So you can password protect individual pages that way. To password protect individual photo albums, I have clicked on Photo Albums and selected the Sarah's Picks album and clicked Edit Album Settings. And again, I've noted the lock icon, the corresponding checkbox, the username and password. That is the functionality that will password protect my photo album. So I'll click that checkbox, enter in the username and password that my site visitors will use to access that photo album and click Save Album and Continue. And to see this in action, I'm going to view my site and click my blog page, which gives the username and password prompt. So I'm entering in the username and password that I assigned in Site Manager that my site visitors will use to access this page. And it let me in, and there's my blog page. And that brings us to the conclusion of this segment of ZoomShare Video Help. Please stay tuned for additional instructional videos, and thanks so much for watching.